Hello Alec. This hand was at a live 2-5 cash game I played and that was shorthanded. What I think makes this hand so interesting was the live reads I had on the villain. I had cleaned him out twice over the night, and after cooling off, he had just bought back in again before this hand. I could see he had his sights set on his chips that were in my stack. My thoughts on his skills so far over the night, was that he was a great aggressive player, while he was winning. But he tilted easily and started making bad plays, at which time his skill dropped off quickly. I am sitting in a small blind with pocket kings. After he raised and got called from the guy on his left, I decided to raise. Then he forebets me. His preflop raise back to me, was made staring directly at me, and I could see he just wanted to crush me. Deciding I could win more by letting him take the reins, I just smooth called. To the flop. The flop comes ace 9-5 with off flush draw. His flop bet was made by the stack he happened to have his hand on, which made me figure it wasn't very calculated. I decided there was no way he is really happy with any hand he had, since any ace in his range would be worried about the flush, and obviously a draw would just be a draw. So when he so confidently tossed his bet out I was certain. I was ahead. The turn check was just pot control on my part. I could see he wasn't happy with the third club either. But I could still see the fearsomeness in his gaze that he was just acting way too tough for his hand. On the river he pushed his chips in, with both hands and covered his face. This was quite a long decision for me to make. But I worked through, and decided that nothing but a bluff made any sense through this hand. So, I called, after taking the pot into consideration. Please let me know if while watching this hand, you think I was probably making correct plays. I'd love to hear some personal inputs about this hand. Any way I can improve my gameplay is a plus. I am constantly watching your videos and extracting as much knowledge as I can out of everyone. Thanks again for all the amazing content, Sean.